everyone. My hands are like look really gross. I'm gonna try my best to have them covered. First, I have a few sushi cards. Nothing for my souffle binder. I don't know if this was double sided in my um previous video like my collection video but yeah finally double-sided my sushi cards and then i also put like the fillers but the only thing that sucks is that these pages are not double-sided so i have to it's kind of annoying to put in but yeah okay so first i got this yuna um forever one card i got this at k play fest and it was only like two dollars so <laughs> oh, where should i put this i think i'm just gonna take out this yeah i'm just gonna put this here for now i don't know about for now actually i think i'm just gonna leave it in here because i don't really want to move things around and like everything looks nice this that actually kind of looks nice okay but it, like really looks cute with the filler I have Yuri's pink Christmas cards from last year. Oh, they're so pretty. I only bought one pack because I really just wanted to fill out these two pages. So yeah. That looks so cute. Okay. Oh yeah, oh my god. Also, I saw Hyoyeon. <laughs> At the time of filming this, I saw her last week, and it was really fun. I went to the club. We saw her after her set. It was really hectic, and I was like overwhelmed. I literally was not saying anything. My friend was like, why isn't this bitch doing anything? Why isn't she moving? Why isn't she saying anything? It's because I was overwhelmed. I was really overwhelmed. I was like, oh my god, I don't want her to get like mobbed. So I was kind of like staying back. But yeah, I mean, I had a great time nonetheless. I actually have a lot of weekly cards. Okay, I also have these. Because um, I traded with my mutual on Instagram, May. They gave me a full set of these. So yeah, I also like, I, I traded them like, a few joa pops and i got a bunch of joa's colorized album cards so it's gonna be fun to put away okay i think i'm gonna put i have these two units so i think i'll put these first also i i haven't decorated this yet so okay jihan is like a few months is like no jay's older by like how many months then than Jihan so I'm gonna put this one first I've been like watching a lot of storing videos lately and I typically don't watch like k-pop collecting kind of videos but I don't know I feel like that's when you know I'm in the mood to film when I'm like watching other people's storing videos oh that's so cute oh my god the backs are so cute but yeah I've been in such a mood to put these away i really love this one this one's stunning i have to like switch this around though ah, so pretty oh my god and then okay i'll put these ones these ones are really cute i don't know what i'm gonna do when i use up all these sleeves because i don't know where to get these because i literally got them in the binder that like they came in oh this one's really cute i really love this one too okay and then this version i need to f switch these again This is one of her broadcast cards. There's a few broadcast cards I want to get for her. Because they're pretty, like, affordable. But yeah, I got this one. This one's so cute. 
And I kind of want to get some more pubs. Because they have a lot of the themed pubs. But I feel like not a lot of people sell weekly anymore. At least on Instagram. So I don't know. And I could buy on Neokill. But I really like buying... Um, oh, also. This one's her Weaver's pub. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, it says Weaver shop. Um, and I got this because it matches the same outfit. But yeah. On Neokill, no one's like selling bundles. I really like buying bundles. Um... But it, people only really sell individual cards now. Okay, anyway, here's everything. I really like this two pocket like situation going on for Joa. I think like also there's A7 ones that fit two pockets, so I might have to look into those binders. But yeah, my Joa collection doesn't grow that much but this is already full because this is a small ring i haven't thought about where to put these just yet for the time being i'll put them in here but i think i want to get like a separate collect book i kind of want one that closes because i hate when like these fill up and they're like not shutting properly so yeah i'm just gonna put them in here i might end up leaving it in here honestly so then is that like a Taki's like I don't know, okay never mind. <laughs> so one day cute. There's actually like a few Monday pops that I've seen that I really like, but let me not do that. <laughs> Jehi. Oh my god, there's also um a Jihan album card that I like. Maybe I'll try to get that. I think album cards are reasonable enough. Thank you, May, for keeping my draw collection alive, my little weekly collection. So I have a few red velvet cards to go in here. I, uh, I don't want to move things around. Okay, I'm going to take out Wenders and I'm going to put her right here. Okay, and then I think I'll move Irene over here. Because I have another birthday card so oh i have a few other member cards literally just wendy and sergi i have sergi's cake version card so cute i have so many birthday cards oh my god but the four cards this era were really cute oh my god i still don't have a wendy okay let me try to get that one Wendy card that I really wanted. I have- <gasps> I don't have room in this collect book. Let me just put these because you should go right after. Chill pills. I got four pink Christmas packs for Red Velvet. And I got Wendy's full set. I kind of want one of Yeti's so I might try to trade these. Or I might try to trade this one for a Yeti but I haven't like really tried to look. So yeah. If anyone has a Yeti to trade for this wendy let me know but i'm gonna put them away for now i really just don't list my photo cards on instagram anymore i'm so lazy to do that i honestly would rather just like look for the trades myself than have people come to me because yeah i just don't want to have to post i just hate it i hate like having to take pictures for trade cell posts now for wendy i don't know what to do with this okay so i have a few wish you hell cards i got the qr version and i don't really want to put away every single qr card because it's quite a lot i i think there's like 10 of them so i just picked my favorite ones um from the two concepts like two each so i i think i might get um min studio has one of these in blue so i might get that okay i'm gonna just take out enough to put to be able to put these in oh my god yeah that would be cute if i get a blue one i'm just gonna put this one here like are y'all seeing the vision like if this was blue that would be so cute right this is the card i pulled this was the one i really wanted so cute 
and then I'll put this version. The way that the like quality of these cards are better than the actual like photo card is like crazy to me. Cause why don't we have this energy for like all photo cards? What the fuck? And then I love this. I wish they gave out like an actual ID. That would have been cute. So yeah, that's the little Wendy section. I actually have a, a lot of joy cards to put away. I think I said that I was gonna get a new binder for Joy. I don't have it yet. I'm not sure what I wanna get. I kinda want um, a macaron one for her. Just cause I really like macaron binders. But also, out of laziness, I haven't gotten one yet, so. Also, I did some reorganizing here cause I bought some like older era cards from my friend Zoe. So yeah, I just kind of, this is finale, oh my god, I think I made like a finale spread, so this is cute, yeah, so yeah, this is her projection keyring card, and I've been eyeing this card for a minute now, I swear I have like the whole like keyring with the photo card in my cart on ebay <laughs> oh i also got a new phone i don't know if like the quality is any better but yeah i got a new phone so that's an another update and then i got her hollow from the trolls pop-up and i think i bought some season greetings cards to go here which is kind of annoying because i had like so many season greetings cards um but yeah whatever Anything to keep this, like, spread, honestly. <laughs> I do not know what's going here. That's so weird. Oh, I think I have- Oh, okay. So I have one of her birthday era pops. I think this is from YZY. I'm not sure, but this is going here, I guess. And then there's, like, a matching one. So maybe I'll get that. But... For now, that's that. I mean, there's other, there's like one birthday era pop that I've been wanting that I just haven't gotten around to getting because of the price. So maybe I'll get that, but I want it to, it's the one that's in this outfit, so I'd want it to be with this card. But I also like that these are all the album cards together. Oh, I also have, finally, I bought. I bought Joy's um, guest version card. I bought this from Oomph Zara. So pretty. Oh my god, this would have been so satisfying if I had like another card. Maybe I'll get the matching one. That's cute. Okay, and then I have this ninth anniversary card. Um, I I'm honestly considering selling this because it's a concept card but also it's pretty so i don't know <laughs> this came with her doll keyring sm really pissed me off with this merch because they didn't even try to get selfies from them like literally i think suki's the only one with like actual selfies i think like irene had like one but then the rest of the members it's all just like concept pictures from r2v like okay Onto chill kill. Oh, also for this, I'm not. I think I'm just gonna. I'm gonna see how many chill kill pops I end up having because I did join for a few. Some of those might go here. So, album cards. I only have two more on hand, but I've completed her album cards. I'm just waiting on my friend Ivy to <laughs> send those out. I'm not sure when she's gonna send it, but yeah she found it on like a chinese proxy site let me put this first because it's on top i think this is my favorite chill kill card for her i think she's so pretty in this i also love her spinny but yeah this one's my favorite i feel like her she's more close up in the package version that's like in this outfit so 
But I kind of want that here, so I think I'll do that. I don't know if you can tell, but it like cut through the sleeve. And then this is her photo book, her sister's version photo book card. Yeah, because this is the package version I pulled. Oh my god, yeah, I just need her eye patch card. Oh wait, no. <gasps> oh, I didn't leave a, a space for her eye patch card. <laughs> oh, okay. That might go here. Um, yeah, I'm just waiting on the other package, the other two package cards. And then I'll be complete with chill kill. And then I have some pops. I have I have a few more pops. They did a lot this era. Maybe I'll start with this one. This is her Star River poster version pop. I got a full set just so I could like for sure have joy because I was like, okay, I need this card because this dog kind of looks like my dog. I still have Sugi. Wendy and Yeti, if anyone needs them. This one is from Make Star. This one's so stunning. And then this one's from MMT. I just got this today. And then this one's from Soundwave, I think. And then this is her Inter Asia Lucky Draw. I got. What else did I get? Oh, I need to get white sleeves. These are so stunning. I just got a good look at this page and it's so pretty. I also have like. Inter Asia. I joined Inter Asia and then of the lucky draws i joined for everline and then music korea i think i have like a vision for how i'm gonna um set up the season greetings cards because i i got a bunch so i don't know i might have to sell some of her pops but also i don't want to i think i also want to get this pop and then this one this is make star and then Essen town I'm trying not to buy Loki. I'm just like, oh my god! And I want these trading cards as well. I have her two pink Christmas cards. So I have a few trading cards and other season greetings cards because Joy's season greetings cards are very stunning, especially the one in like the heart dress. Those are so pretty. But also, I might end up selling the concept cards. I don't know. It, it honestly depends on... I don't know. I It's like very likely that I might sell the concept cards. Kind of annoying because I don't have many cards. But I feel like I bought a lot. <laughs> I think I want to put this one. I, I like these cards more. So I think I'm going to put this here. Oh, these are her photo pack cards. I have her Apple Music pop that's in this outfit on the way, so that's gonna go here. And then I have, I'm pretty sure I have two concept cards in this outfit. Yeah, I think I might actually sell the concept card. I don't remember what the other concept card I got looks like, so I'll just leave that there for now. This one's very stunning though. Okay, that's all for Joy definitely do for a new binder because oh my god i have a bunch of eight pink cards but it's mostly because i actually bought their season greetings this year for the first time in like a while in a few years um because my friend gave me a gift card for my birthday to a k-pop store so i was like let's take advantage of this to get a season greetings because i was not gonna get one otherwise I'm gonna put away all the other number stuff. I need to get some. I feel like the more economical way of making fillers is definitely like just cutting up some paper, but I'm so lazy. Like, oh, also, they announced an aping comeback, which is kind of overwhelming because Lucembo obviously <laughs> is also in April. I don't know. I might just try to back collect and not join so many goes because honestly i'm already kind of getting overwhelmed well actually like 
the amount of loose sample pops that are coming out right now is not that much it's not too bad right now i've i think i've joined like five goes though out of there's only like a few that i didn't join so it's like that's pretty good in my opinion like that's not a crazy amount yet unless i'm like mistaken i don't know there might be a crazy amount and i'm just like being delusional i just won't join the like earlier group orders the pops that come out earlier on are usually just like really similar to album cards typically um it was like that for a pink a pink class comeback so i might just try to wait it out for the more themed card they only did like i don't know how i think they only did like two kind of themed cards for dnd so i don't know this is gonna be their first group comeback in like two separate labels so i don't know how it's really gonna work out but the weekly had a lot of themed cards so i feel like that's just the norm now these are the two group cards for from their season greetings very cute they gave calendar cards i don't know they were so generous with photo cards oh and namju had a solo comeback i love the like b-sides on the on her single album they're very good the second coming of ikyori over here i still haven't gotten my copy yet because the last time i went to a k-pop store they didn't have it but i also only went to one k-pop store so i didn't really like see if any of the other stores had them but yeah i haven't been to koreatown in a while because yeah i don't i literally just go school home school home these days these four are just like the normal photo card set they had panda pubs for oh my god they had panda and then the bunny blanket what do i i think i want maybe like the kiki's delivery service theme that would be cute and what else i don't know they do like glasses ones too and i feel like that's so simple but like they're so cute to me like the lucemble glasses pops from the from store are so cute these are the calendar cards there's the the dragon ones like y'all know the the dragon plushie that's kind of like a light pink color <laughs> yeah i hope they stay away from that little plushie i'm not feeling that one i do hope they have these like 30 year old women holding plushies i'm not gonna lie i would eat that up i could also do like the member cards together too but i think this looks cute and there's this one very reminiscent of like joy's happy birthday to you concept other themes are popular these days oh my god i hope that a pink do pretty kura pops that would be so cute i think that's getting like kind of more popular these days i've seen like ats have pretty kura ones and then there was another there was another girl group i saw that had those i don't remember who oh i think it was nmix pops need to be eradicated and then I'm over here. Okay, so I want you to hold a plushie for these pops. I wonder if they do like egg cards. I don't know if I really love egg cards or not. I feel like they have to be like... I don't know. They just have to look... Mm, never mind. I don't know. I Yeah. Egg cards. Don't know if I love them. They might be a little played out at this point. Oh my god. I don't really like the pops that are like heart. Like half heart ones. Even though I have these album cards, but these are so cute. <laughs> this one's a cheek poke one. <gasps> this is so pretty. I don't know why everyone decided to all of a sudden have a comeback in April. And then there's Artemis too. I was thinking about collecting Jinsel and Chitty because they're part of my bias line. But I mean, if I didn't collect them for Audrey Circle, I feel like I, I wouldn't really want to. I don't know. Because their album is not going to have like objects this time because i don't know they're gonna be distributed in america i guess look at me talking about luna already i'm not even in that part of the video yet 
Okay, let me let me save that for when I put away Luna. Yeah, that's the season reading cards. I don't know what I'll put here. Maybe I could get more D&D cards. I actually have a bunch of D&D cards, so maybe I should just get one from my trade sale or two. I also don't have any Bomis, so maybe I should get the are my D&D cards. <gasps> should I give this and Jesus this one's cute. I've been to a few trading events recently and every time people look through my aping section they're like what group is this? Okay Nugus. That's my Nugus right there. I feel bad that I don't have Bomi in here so maybe I'll keep a Bomi. And then maybe I'll keep this Chono. I know that I do like this Chono. <gasps> oh my god. All my trinkets fell. Oh since this one is like in this pose, I feel like this should go here. Bomi is older than NG by like a few days. <laughs> so I'll do this. And then, yeah, I kind of want them to be together. Yo, I hate these sleeves. I don't know if like Ultra Pro is making their sleeves like slightly bigger. I don't want to get smaller sleeves because I love how snug they are in there. Cause they do not move, like none of these bitches are falling out. See, look like they are not falling out. It does annoy me when they start ripping through the pages. We'll have to get Namju very soon. I may have to go take a trip to Koreatown sometime. I said go take a trip, like it's like a long drive. Hey, it's like less than 10 minutes away from me by the way. And then my Heim binder. I oh oh my god wait okay these go in my other binder and I did not make space for really. these. She had her solo debut in 2019, so that would go somewhere here. This was before. Oh my god. No. Okay, I know that I have two spaces open somewhere here, and I think I might just um, put them there for now, and then move this around another time because I I don't want to deal with that right now. These are two of her broadcast cards from her solo debut. Her solo album doesn't have like actual photo cards; they had Polaroids, which was a pain in the ass to get. But I got all of them and that's like... And I don't even get to really see them that much because they're Polaroids and I do not look at my bigger inclusion. So that's annoying. I might try to get the other two. I think there's two more. This will be rearranged off camera. <laughs> For this binder. I still haven't gotten a card to fill this out. Oh yeah, actually, I did. I did get the k-town pop that is um in this outfit and then i got the one that's in here so i might have to move this eventually oh i have to move this one too yeah these are from their fan con and then i have card to go here so this is her who's fan winner card pretty sure this is her winner card Okay, that's so cute and then i haven't gotten a pop to go here yet or like her qr card i'm gonna have to move so i'm just gonna put this to the side and then just put this to fill the space i have this one this is also a winner card from soundwave oh no i don't want to put this here Move bunty blanket and then maybe these two could go together. I'll just put this here. It looks cute enough with the blue. I don't know, that looks cute. I got a bunch of new fillers, but I only use these for my 
so funny and my high -end collections which they don't grow that much so i'm like maybe i should do this for the assemble but also i'm worried that i'm gonna go through these like really quickly for the assemble and i'm gonna have to keep buying so oh my god and these are like from korea i'm also kind of a little bit over these binder fillers i do like the look of the white sleeves or like the white backgrounds a lot more oh my god that's so cute wait i have one i have this one but since this one is like green i feel like this would look cute oh my god yeah I think there were like a few pops for the season greetings which they also like okay pops for season greetings evil pops that are random one member per season greetings even more diabolical give a set at least come on so yeah i'm not gonna collect pops i think it looks nice that it's just like one page for her these will go somewhere else because I, I don't want to get rid of these because it's Hyung and also Heejin that's my Hyung binder I did kind of fill out some spaces so that's nice Ooh, oh my god I actually have so many like other member cards for Espa I'm gonna try to put this in order I think I did go through this and make a few spots i'm definitely gonna have to use a different binder because this is not all gonna fit i did do some reorganizing in here so these wait what did i do <laughs> i got some life's too short cards so these are all life's too short i think these are all trading cards actually these are so pretty and then i have this one's one of Min Jung's bunny hat ones. I kind of want to get her cheese puff. Oh, what is it? Cheese balls? <laughs> cheese balls Min Jung. I got one of Eddie's girls cards. I think I got this at K-Play. Oh my god, at K-Play they had so many like- Not so many, but they had like people selling photo cards. Yeah, I went kind of crazy. So I got the gummy worm Min Jung pink Christmas card. And I'm pretty sure SMC you should go first, but since I have Pink Christmas here, I'm just gonna continue on with Pink Christmas. But yeah, I got this SMCU card. I have one of Karina's pop-up trading cards. Well, that was cute. It, they both have like a purple background. And then I got this Minjong. I really wanted this one to like match this Eddie. so cute oh i guess this is the end of this collect book but yeah i have two karina my world or not my world welcome to my world oh no yeah i was right my world so this is an album card and then this one's a pop this one is from i don't remember what i feel like this would look cute with this one though and then i should move minjong Okay, I think I might do that actually. Cute. And that's all for this binder. I might put this in the front. Because this looks kind of odd. <laughs> Hold up. I need a card back here. I'm going to put Ning Ning's um, SMCU Palace ID card because this is PVC. So this is going to go back here. Just to protect card from this oh my god it's so dusty this is one of the beyond d three ring binders i got this giselle trading card and it would look perfect here so i'm gonna use her as a little like cover or whatever <gasps> cute i have two drama cards so this is her giant version card oh my god this sleeve is really gross i'll just leave it and then this is one of her sequence cards so i got one of her 
few christmas cards i kind of just bought this because i was getting one card and i was like i should make the shipping a little bit worth it so i got this oh also they were like oh you have to get another card on my page if you want to get a pop so i was like okay i'll just get this karina i also like she was the only member i didn't have for pink christmas anyway so i also have eddie and mindong and these came with the packs that i bought for us but i bought four i really liked eddie so i i really wanted to get her and then yeah mindong's are so pretty i really want the one with the star cookie but this one's also cute because it's like a snowman and her like thing is like the little snowman with one hand or with one arm so <laughs> okay this is all my uni cards i have a few my world cards okay problem i have her amazon i think this is oh no this is oh no yeah this one's her amazon exclusive now i'm just missing her walmart one but i think that one's a little bit harder to get i don't really mind not having it and then i have these uh well these two are training cards so i feel like i could put these two together uh oh what do i do with this card oh my god <laughs> well okay these two are stage outfits so maybe i could put these two together and then i just put this one here so i have one of her my world trading cards and it's in the thirsty stage outfit or like one of them and i don't know if there's one for minjong i have like karina and eddie's in like the same stage outfit and that would be nice to have one for minjong because they all looked really cute in that one this one's kms right i've been wanting this one for so long there were like a few times where i almost caved and bought it for like 30 dollars on poco market but i got this for i don't remember how much i paid but it was a really good price and then better things so this is the one i already had i was thinking about collecting all of these but with how this works out i think these two are enough but yeah this one okay cute kind of a mix match page i feel like these should go up here because they're like stage outfits and then these are like kind of after promotions ish so yeah maybe i'll do that What I'm gonna do with this card, I don't know. <laughs> this one's really cute though. I don't I don't wanna sell it. I don't know yet. I'll put this to the side. So drama era. How was I gonna do this? Oh, okay, this one goes here. And then I think I'm gonna do this and then this. Actually I think I might put this one right here though. Or maybe these two oh okay yeah that's what i was gonna do i'm pretty sure this is her scene version card there were a few us exclusives of her in this outfit but i only really cared about her barnes and noble us exclusive this time oh my god so cute i traded the eddie that i pulled i love this card so much and then one of her sequence cards. I like I should put sequence together, but I'm so much more about putting cards that like match each other well together. And she has like the leather jacket in this one, so and then her giant version card. Yay. So now my Ningning drama era like album cards are complete pretty much just what i'm collecting for evening i think i got a pop that's in this outfit so i might end up moving this but yeah i got a few drama era cards oh my i actually don't know what i have on the way i do i i do know i have a few i'll put this one 
first. This one's her reverse pop. It's from like, I think this is a countdown live one. Um, these two are from the pop up trading cards. So, this one, what is this from? Oh, this is her with Mew Lucky Draw. Oh my god, like, might be my favorite trauma era card. She's just so, like, Kuromi in this. And then this one is from. I think this one's KMS. Or no, 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 not KMS. Oh, this is from Warner Music Japan. Onto Pink Christmas. I bought her other card on Miyokyo, so don't have that on hand yet, but I have these two. These are just like my pulls from the group order I joined. I really wanted this unit. Y'all already know I love Audis. Yeah, I'm just gonna put the other unit here. So then I, I just have like a full Pink Christmas page. And then I have Season Greetings. So I think I wanna put these at the top and then these two on the bottom this one's one of her trading cards so cute and then this one's her photo pack card and then this is her season greetings card the one that actually comes in the season greetings this one's also a trading card cute can't wait to get the other pink christmas cards to fill this out Also need a new Ning Ning binder. This is like the main event for me, honestly. I've been so excited to put away my Lusumble cards, but first I have a few like other member cards. I actually don't know if this is the right order. I think this should be. This is Jinsel's to Orbit photo book card. Or one of them. So cute. I do have this up for trade on my trade sale instagram I'm, i only have it up for trade for a go on um lucky draw from sensitive because i cannot find it for the life of me if someone like has to trade this i'll trade it for that but other than that i'm keeping her i think this should go after this actually but i'm just gonna leave it like that and then i have this flip that sound wave pop i'm pretty sure this is sound wave also have this up for trade but only to, for that go on Oh wait, oh my god, I have this. This should go with this one actually. Okay, I'm gonna move this. Maybe I could put this here. I'll just put Eve here. Or actually no. I'll just put this one here. I got Hyunjin's cat trading card i traded my kissy chew from ant for this do i regret that mm, i don't know but also part of me does regret it because a lot of people are looking for that card and they have like the chitty chitty card and then let me just put these back oh you may have noticed that i moved out my like re-debut card this is just gonna be like other miscellaneous luna like bbc cards and then i moved my re-debut cards to my big luna binder because they just worked out better layout wise in my big binders i actually do have something that's like bbc luna i got heju's down jumper card mostly just to fill this page out and then i got her look look card I literally like bought a fucking like big like bundle of Jinsel and Heju cards just to get this. Now I'm kind of on the hunt for Chidi because oh my god, like this is like a top top set for me to get top three for. Chidi is also pretty high demand. There was like I saw someone put up Chidi's bandana card for trade and they were like looking to trade for like go on non-album stuff and they had this on their wish list and i was highly highly considering 
treating this and i kind of regret not doing it i'm not gonna lie i mean this is looking a lot better than it was so i don't know if i'll really get anything else for this like this looks pretty good to me on to re-debuts so i put l'assemble first just because they're like i guess they're my alt group like amongst like the re-debuts i guess so so i guess i'm gonna do l'assemble artemis and then like eve 2 first i have a full set of like their ever music egg cards i got a bunch of inclusions with the group originally joined so i was like might as well get an ot5 set i was literally just gonna store hyunjin vv and go on on this page but then i had so many um extra cards that i also wanted to keep so both her ever music cards the backs are gonna look a little off this is my favorite Hyunjin and then Yajin this is also her ever music card and then this last BV um, this is one of her album cards from the space version <gasps> I love this page oh my god okay these two little symbol pages I mean the back doesn't look too bad well it doesn't matter y'all can even see it for Ari circle i traded for kim lips 210 card so that i could complete this set i really like how this looks it just so happened that i already had this complete and then i had like these extra cards for each member so i think this looks cute i feel like if there was another set i'd want it's maybe this set but i think i these that's cute i joined a group order for um one of heejin's objects i think i got a full set of her clear cards so i'm just gonna put it here and then this one i feel like when artemis debuts i might just move these up and then fill this out and then maybe just start putting them on the back too i said that i was gonna do artemis and then Chu and Eve together. Okay, for now I'm gonna leave it like this. And then once I get more, I guess, Artemis cards, I'll move this around. This is just um, one of her, I forgot which version, I, one of Chu's solo cards. This is like my one of my pulls. I had it in my trade sale binder because I only wanted two when it was like in the collect book. And then Heejin, I got this one is 219. This was the one I really wanted. But yeah, I really wanted this one. So yeah, I'm just gonna try to get another one to go here. That looks cute. I actually have these. These are like fan-made objects. These two. Actually, I think this goes after. that looks pretty cute okay that's all for the, the big binder oh my god i love lucembo guys like i think i'll probably do the same thing for um one of a kind and get like one card per version for hyunjin yeojin and vivi mostly because i'm definitely gonna get a bunch of inclusions so <laughs> might as well i'm definitely gonna want pink yeojin cards so for Lucembol, I have this huge, huge stack. I watched a little bit of my last storing video because I'm gonna be honest, sometimes I watch my storing videos when um, I'm not really feeling like the groups that other people put away. I'm literally like, why don't people stand the exact same groups that I do? I think I left like two pages like empty for pubs, but I kind of went crazy okay all right okay so for this page so i got replicas of hechu and guan's run orbit cards if i could find them 
I just saw them. Oh, they're right here. Okay. I don't know if I like how these ones look, so I might just... Well, they're fine, actually. These are going here. I did set up for some cards, but then I also got other cards, like, since setting up, so... I might have to rearrange a little bit. Okay. And then Aladdin, which is the mirror selfies. Oh. Uh, and then I also have Hedju's cat heart. This was like the Hedju card that I really wanted to get. Like when the album first dropped. Back then, I wasn't planning on collecting Hedju at all. Collecting both Guan and Hedju has been really fun, so. I don't really see myself stopping anytime soon. This is her sound wave card. Cute. I don't know what I think there's like the half heart pops that are in the dream version ones. But I said I don't really care for those. Okay, next. Okay, so I think this one is the one going up here. This is Hedges Everline Lucky Draw. I think this is the offline one. Oh my god. If you have the Go On equivalent, please sell it to me. Please, please, please. I'm like so desperate to get that card. And then. Wait, I have Hedges K Town for you heart. Oh, here. Cute. Oh my god. This page is gonna look so cute. And then market shop. Oh my god, I got these at one of the trading events I went to. And it was literally when I was like, oh, like me and my friend were about to leave. And then I was like, oh, can we do like one round? Like just going around one time. And I went through this person's binder and I was like, oh my god, they have the market shop like rose head juice. So I had to get it. I was almost not going to get go on. And they were selling it for a pretty good price. So it's a win for Sufanis. And then these are the, I'm pretty sure these are the online um, Everland Lucky Draws. These ones are really cute. I love this head juice so much. Please, someone sell me this one, please. I think I have, yeah, I have Hedge's message card from the Everline Lucky Trust, so I'm just gonna put this here. I don't know, I got this as a freebie pretty much, so I'm just gonna stay there. Okay. Oh my god, these were like my favorite cards for the longest time. Like, they're so pretty to me. I got Market Shop through a group order, and I think they ordered from like um, K Twit. I love them so much. I love Gwan's pops in this outfit, like specifically. Okay, so I got these two and I don't have Gwan. So this is Heju's keyring card. This came in the big set that I got um, the claw Heju. And then this is Hello Live. This one is like oddly big. It's like way bigger than not way bigger, but it's like bigger than normal photo card size. And then I have this one in this group order. I joined like two Lucembo group orders that were like from KTwit, so I don't know. It's in either of those. I love these ones. Okay, these are the Soundwave Lucky Draws. make star okay here's panda and then the princess ones oh my god these ones are also very stunning at first i had only claimed go one because at that time i wasn't collecting hedju i was kind of having a hard time finding this card i ended up finding her from someone that was like selling a bunch of other hedju pubs at once so that was nice and then this is also for Make Start, yeah. The panda ones. At first I could not find this Heju. 
so then I bought a full set from the group order manager that I've been joining with and then after that it started popping up like that would happen to me this page is so cute okay I think these most of these I have in group orders but there's one that I have on hand well, I'm not sure which fan sign it is and where the hell is she oh so this one's music and drama i'm kind of in the habit of putting heju and then go on because heju faces this way and then go on faces this way and i like it that they're like facing like the center so then i like putting heju here and then go on if that makes sense so like like here they're doing that here like i don't know i feel like that's just such a little thing to notice but yeah i keep accidentally putting heju first is what i'm trying to say hello live for hello live at first i was only gonna collect heju's purikura but i ended up getting all three on this page i'm putting the purikuras and the cat ones because these are the same outfits for these pops so I love this one so much. I didn't really care for these, but now that I have them in real life, they're so cute. Especially Goans, I love Goans a lot. I went to get these ones because these hedges are really cute. Okay, and then Hello Live Bunny Blanket. These two. I feel like I these are the ones that I care about the least, so these may be on the chopping block, I'm not gonna lie. One thing about me, I am I have such a hard time like selling off cards that are my biases. Especially go on when I was like kind of downsizing on my go on cards i had such a hard time like really like being strict about downsizing i have the bunny heart one i also have the one where they're wearing the bunny like um headband but that one came is coming from a group order and the group order manager is kind of mia right now so yeah i only have this one for now i bought the heju equivalent these are one of the last cards that came out so i don't know why i'm is there a different one this is a... who's fat right yeah hold on oh i think it's because bunny bunny blanket that's why i'm doing it um okay I, i'll just leave it like that for now okay and then from i think these are from yes Oh my god, these are my favorite ones. I think I'll put these at the top. And then the earmuffs. I feel like if I were to downsize, I I would probably sell these. But I don't know, downsizing is not really on the brain right now. I'm not really <laughs> thinking about downsizing my Lusumbo collection just because I love collecting them so much like i have not loved collecting pubs as much as i've loved collecting loose symbol pubs like it's just so satisfying collecting two members dear my muse i bought vv day but i'm kind of worried that the go on vv day pub that i bought is lost in the mail so and it's kind of crickets with the hedge one that i bought so i might have to rebuy those but i have the steamed bun dear my muse ones so cute i kind of bought these on a whim because i didn't join for these ones but now i'm like why did i not because these outfits are so cute heju day oh no these are hyunjin day i think the heju day ones are the only ones i didn't get and those are the choco pie ones but i don't really care for for those ones i know those ones are kind of popular amongst like other loose symbol pops but i don't really care for them these ones are super cute though they're doing the aeon pose 
and Gohan has like a little teddy bear. Someone's selling a signed one of this one, and I'm highly, highly considering buying it. And then, okay, Gohan Day is the fairy one. These ones, these ones are super cute. Especially, I love this Heju. Honestly, don't ask why it's in this order. I'm honestly, I, I do not know. Like, up to here, I get why, but then past this, I'm like, okay, let's just try to make this look cute. Especially this, because these came after these pops. So, I don't know why I did that. I'm not gonna lie. I might... Okay, yeah. Okay, it's kind of bothering me that this is out of order, so I'm gonna put these over here. These like have a lot of air in them when I put them in, so hopefully these flatten out. I fear that I'm losing space. Okay, let me just like get all the pops out because there's some that I didn't make spaces for. Uh, these are pops. I did buy one of Heju's equivalents of this, so I have to move these around. Oh my god, wait, these even go before this, so let me just move these around again. I think there's definitely one that I have to buy. I think it's, I don't know. There's one Heju that I'm still missing. Okay, um, and then I definitely have to move these around. I might have a whole, like, just go on section, because there's a few cards that I have only go on for, so that might have to be this section. And I also might have to get a new binder soon. Actually, not might. I definitely have to get a new one. And I'm thinking about getting a wide Meow Cafe, like A5 binder that's like six pockets. And then I would just do like go on and head you like, you know, instead of next to each other. But I do like how they look like this too. I just don't want to keep buying a new binder every era. I guess this is a sign that I should like cut down. I have her fan sign winner card. I definitely want to get Heju for this, but hers is kind of harder to find for a good price. And then I have this Soundwave Lucky Draw unit. I love Hyunwon, so I had to get this. I'm so excited to get more Hyunwon cards for one of a kind. I'm so happy they're doing units. I'm not sure how I'm going to collect that yet. I'm kind of just thinking of doing all the Hyeon, all Hyunwon, and then maybe like two Hyunhae just to fill up the spaces that will be left over. I don't know yet. Let me get all the fan con stuff. Oh my god, I have this going. These are all fan con, fan con, these two. Uh, these are love symbol. I got her a sweatshirt card. I still do want Heju, but she's kind of harder to get. Okay, so I'm doing Clue. And then I have the FanCon binder cards here. Okay, I actually have those on hand. And then I think I'm gonna put these concept cards here. I also have the IDs for the Clue membership cards, so I don't know where to put those. I might just end up putting those on the side. I feel like I wanted the ID cards more than I wanted the the actual photo cards. I like really like ID cards now, or like ID photos. Don't really know why. Okay, yeah, but these are the binder cards. These are the concept cards from the training card. Fan con training cards. I kind of want more, um, but this kind of just works out nicely, so if I do get 
Hedges cheat cart one, I'll probably end up selling one of these. And then season greetings. Some of their cutest cards, I swear. Honestly, if I didn't like a pink season greetings, I probably would have gotten their season greetings. Or maybe red velvet actually. I really liked the red velvet season greetings for this year. Peach Hedu. And then watermelon Hedu. Now I just need Cherry Cherry because then I would have like my top three with their like official fruit. <laughs> Since now I have like a watermelon Hedu and then I have the pineapple go on from Luminous. And then I have Love Symbol. So I did buy two go on cards. So I got a full set. Oh wait, this one, this is her wine cup one, and then this is a pop. So yeah, I bought the full tin case, and oh my god, this group order was a fucking mess. I'm not gonna talk about it here. Let's just say that the group order manager kind of scammed Everline, <laughs> but I got my stuff, so good thing I didn't get like too much from that group order, because that would have been so fucking annoying to have to deal with like getting a refund and shit, um, but yeah. Uh, anyway, these are their tin case cards. Tin case cards. And then, okay, I think what I might end up doing if I get a new binder. It's not if, it's when. When I get a new binder is start from here. It is bothering me that this is so, like, like curved like that that's really annoying i don't want any of my cards to start curving so her wine cup card and then i'll have her candle one here and then her pop this one is so stunning i was almost not gonna collect this but this is so stunning in real life so then i got some like fan made cards so these came like I'm not sure exactly what these are from. They're something to do with the Clue membership. So that's everything. Let's do a flip through because this is literally so much. This is a little too full. <laughs> Hopefully that flattens out once I close it. Oh my god, look at that. Okay, please close. I also have this group card. And I think I might put this here. They kind of have like pink outfits on. I don't know how to put it though. It's kinda... I'll just put it like that for now. Let me actually end off on this page i love this page thank you for watching that was very fun and satisfying putting away my little symbol cards even if there's like little holes that need to be filled i'm so happy to be able to put these away also really excited to collect one of a kind see you guys in the next video